All right, welcome back, folks. Uh, this is what we have. <laughs> this is how things are working right now. We lost uh, two people last time, and we are now Porstein, who I'm not a fan of. Porstein. Sorstein, Thorstein? I have no idea. And I should probably figure that out. Yeah, the kind of the guy I wanted to play as least. But Ramung's here. He's waiting for us to die. Uh, I guess we could have never married if we had wanted to. Uh, but we haven't had our own child, our own heir yet. Of course, we were taking concubines and stuff, which is going to make that happen pretty quickly. But really, our whole goal is to change to an elective monarchy anyways. But we have to reign for 10 years, and... Oh, good, no vassals are fighting each other anymore. And uh, no vassal count or above has a negative opinion. So we could go to high crown authority, and everyone would hate us. And they might even kill us. Uh, but they probably rebel first. Yeah, we don't want the negative vassal opinion that high. I mean, it'd be the minus 20, which is another negative 10 on top of what we already have, plus like negative 30 for changing crown law and all that garbage. So I uh, will just stay here. That's fine. So really what we're kind of working on now is this. We're going to start that war once our blot is completely done and all that stuff. We need money badly, though. So we can have another one for a while, but... People like us a little bit more. In the meantime, we got a little extra prestige and piety. Our piety is going up one and a half per turn. Our prestige is going up almost nine a turn. And obviously we'll get more here as well. He accepted the peace offer, so that was not in his benefit. He's declared Guy's host claim. I wonder if she just gave it up immediately. No, he doesn't have anything. weird because um, they do it in the opposite order so that first one came and then he immediately whatever whatever so oh that means that we don't have any truces with any of these people we can actually take some of this other stuff now in fact um, intrigue, Commissioner Runestone. We can do that during wartime, it seems. So I'm not going to waste the money right now. Um, but yeah, we should uh, we should take Sussex. Why not? Who are your allies? Duke of Franconia and Count of Nassau. Yeah, I'm not really worried about that. You have current troops, a hundred. <laughs> you are at war. Oh, defending against the revolt. Excellent. And the revolt's winning. Well, yeah, we totally need to take this now. So this is probably the best. Actually, that might be better. Should I take this? See, I don't even know what to take anymore. That's closer to my lands. This gives me water. I kind of prefer that, I think. Oop. Oh, we have raised army levies somewhere. Darn it. Oh, the vassal one's over here, so I can do the that thing. Okay, we'll finish this thing real quick. As I promised. We'll actually just do it this time. Man, it's taking for bleeding ever. There we go, finally. Okay, you're full. We'll have you come back. Do that thing. Uh, in the meantime, I'm going to do a little cheaty deal just to do this as fast as possible. Oop, wrong one. go this one should go much quicker
That's coming back. Kind of at least want to burn through the bishopric. Princess of Ruskov, Slipshod Faction. Oh wow, look at all these people I may have to fight soon. Uh, what do I want? Plots. Okay, well, you are a chief dis of that. You don't like me. Wait, what? Oh, chief dis. Yeah, she's not the actual chief dis. Okay. So you're probably not involved in anything. Who wants independence? You know what? I would gladly give you independence. I don't want this land at all. Unless, of course, you would come on false religion. Yeah, I don't really want to deal with that. I mean, someone else will go up there and take it, but, I mean, it's pretty much useless. There's no reason for this. Makes no money. It's way, be way behind in tech. Um, he had that much support? Oh, yeah, because he's leading it. That's interesting. So he would choose... If I give him independence, someone else would probably just start up the independence faction. You know what? I'm going to give it to him. Um, grant independence. Goodbye. He thinks he has a claim, huh? Eh. We'll deal with that stuff when we get to it. Let's go. Let's just finish all this stuff. Two more ticks. Called arms. Crap. A holy war? Wait, what? I'm confused. Uh huh? I own all of Wessex. My vassals do. But somehow she has the duchy. I guess I just should have revoked it. Where is she even... I probably could, I probably could have revoked it. Well, yeah, I'll definitely accept that. I should have done it, but it shouldn't have been a holy war either. You're an idiot, by the way. That puts us with war with him. Oh, wait, she... Oh, I see what happened. Never mind. Crap, yeah, we definitely should have declared war earlier. And now we can't declare war on her anymore, because we're in a separate war. Dang it. Well, May 26th, May 30th. Wow. That's a lot of bad troops. Well, let's go help. Apparently we can't even help. We're just going to battle afterwards.
Okay, we're just standing here waiting for our turn, apparently. So that happened. Kind of weird. Wesleyan Revolt. Actually, this is our chance to uh, to take this. Hmm. Interesting. Well, let's get over there then. Vassal armies raised too long. I get that. We've taken all of this now, basically. These guys need to get on the ship. Oh, don't want to go there. Go there. Actually, let's just go there. Head bond. Oh, this one. Okay. Good. So we need to declare war on him as soon as we lower our troops. It means we have to get our troops out of his territory, though, as well. Okay, so... Bye-bye. Okay, two. You. I declare war on you. Or Mortain. Offer peace. Ah, uh, so cheap. Find people to give it away to. Uh, da, 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 da. That looks good. Search my vassals. Marshal of Breda. Our steward. We don't really want to get rid of our steward. Oh, he's ambitious. That's right. Uh, yeah, you're fine. Mortain and everything that it has. Good job. Okay. Actually, we need to not be in here, though. That's the only bad part about this plan. Going to Kent. Let's also go to Kent. Okay. Oh, see, now they're going to kill the stupid... You're not supposed to do that! So, we're going to try it. It's not going to work, but we'll do it anyways. Oh, no! <laughs> oh, why did you raise more troops up? Yeah, we're not going to get this one. Because he's going to give up now. We might be able to assault through it in time. Uh, you, you need something to do. Ooh, are you independent? You are independent. <laughs> nice. Uh, let's just double check real quick on who your allies are. Couple counts, that shouldn't be an issue. Cool. I always love it when those guys become independent. Uh, we also can attack these, we'll work our way over there. Not bad. I'm not going to bother assaulting through this because he's probably just going to cancel. Range marriage offer, huh? Nephew to a courtier. She's possessed, depressed, strong. She's got a lot of children already. Um, I don't want them to leave.
He's Old Norse. How's your son, Old Norse? Well, maybe she'll fix him? I don't know. Sure, why not? Oh, crap. She wasn't like... Oh, she was. She was something, wasn't she? Maybe not. Oh. Ah. Uh, dang it. Children of the Black Guardians. Yeah, whatever. And who's the other one? Dag. Sure. Doesn't matter. Okay, victory there. 226. Oh yeah, we'll just assault right through these when we get the chance. Make sure they stay cheap. I mean, it's a little too many mercenaries to be honest. We're not making nearly as much money as we used to. Crap! <laughs> In fact, we're losing a ton of money every month. Uh, we're going to have to drop some mercenaries. But, in the meantime... So many ambitious people. Why don't you like me? Patient verse, verse of wrath. You're greedy and ambitious, you're easy to bribe. You're cowardly and craven and all that kind of stuff. We'll choose you. It pays to be craven sometimes. Evaru. Oh, he loves us a hundred. That's what content gets you. Or was he wasn't content, was he? Who was he? Yeah, he's content. Content is great. Okay, well while we still have these guys and can't afford them. Let's um, declare war on you. Okay, your allies are... Yep, nobody. Should I wait until we get closer? Ostrogotland's out there. Interesting. Everybody's raiding, except for me. I should just get all those boats together and go raiding. What was that deal with the... Um... As long as we're at war... Do these cost monthly, though, or is it just a flat 50 gold? Because I can get a flat 50 gold very quickly. Oh, it's only 20 ships. It's only 200 gold they carry. Never mind. How many personal ships do I have? They just cost so much to have raised, too. I have only have 23. Well, the cost is only 103? I guess it's different for... Uh, I could make my vassals hate me and then have 100 ships. Very tempting. Okay, well, let's get over here. Or maybe over here. That's just personal holding. He'll raise his guys. We'll come in. We'll assault. We'll do all that. Hmm. All Densian uprising. <laughs> okay. Declare war. Brabant. Send. Go wipe out his troops. Salt. Salt. Oh, is that not part of the war anymore? No, it is. Okay. Been watching a lot of EU4. And sometimes I get confused now with CK2. The way it does wars and battles and stuff.
got a mayor. Perfect. Peace. Uh, we'll accept. Uh, you poor, poor man. Okay, let's do this thing again. Our steward. Mm. Oh, he's... Yeah, we don't want to do that. Uh, you. You're the guy who doesn't like us quite as much. But short range going down pretty quick, and we're going to be giving you a lot of stuff. So we'll just do it. So this would be the county of Brabant. Oh, he likes us 100. There's lots of stuff there. Oh, good. Okay, hey, loon guy. We want Kiev or whatever it was. Actually, we could take either one. Uh, which one do we want? One that borders something else we want. Like that guy. So we want that one. Clev. Oh, do you own Colm too? No? I'm confused. Whatever. Well, he's got a decent amount of troops there. I'll take the crossing penalty anyways, whatever. Actually, wait. Before we do, let's just assault through his stuff here. Much rather assault through the stuff we're not going to get. Oh yeah, we got all sorts of people now in our jail. Let's check that out. We're 22 minutes, probably ought to end this soon. Who's new? Saw a mayor in here somewhere. He's usually worth some money. 25 gold, ransom him to himself? Yeah, sure, why not? Uh, who else? Twenty-six year old? Her husband's the leader of the revolt. Her diplomacy is actually ten. She's not a bad character, except for the intrigue. Uh, some good stuff here. Hmm. You get anything? We'll get some prestige. Ah, what the heck. Um, actually, that's a lot of money right now. <laughs> Abductor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, if you kill me and I don't have an heir, I'll be okay with that. Ramon will take charge. Okay, so let's assault. Oh, uh, we got shticked. We can actually hold shticked for right now. Yeah, let's do that. Somerset. How about the one that you're working on? No man better increasing church opinion of me or teach me to become a more pious man than my seer queen. Oh, I didn't even look at what my ambition was. I have no valid ambitions. But I have a feeling that it is... Learning? I don't know, but I should have valid ambitions. Weird. Your church approves. So we can either get a slightly bit more piety, or have all of our church people like us more for a year. Okay, she's just doing her job because she's really good. Why can't we choose an ambition? Maybe he canceled an ambition right before I took him over, and it's not time again. That should be part of the tooltip, tell you why there's no valid ambitions. Okay, let's do that. Uh, Brittany's now involved, that's fine. We have new leader of a faction. New independence faction. The yeah, problem is if we get rid of these guys, this stuff's gonna fire. 
We won't be able to afford to hire them again. But we're making more than 20 a month as long as we keep doing this. So, see, there's 20 right there. In fact, if we wanted to, since we border these, we could be looting. Oh, we got through this. I'm surprised that hasn't it. Oh, it's grown. Interesting. Very interesting. Okay. I'll oh, we'll keep doing it. In fact, is he doing anything? What's going on here? Who are you? What's happening? It doesn't look like you're sieging. Can I come over here and siege? That'll make things go a little quicker. Let's try it. Uh, but we should be doing something over here, right? Like assaulting? So, England won. What does that mean? Who owns that? Who owns Wessex? She still does. Did she convert? She did not. No, wait. Let's try this again. Her. She's still at war. Oh, the revolt. Right. So after that, we might be able to usurp. Uh, we can just take Sussex right now. Or whatever we want. Surrey or Sussex. But not that. Oh, wow. There's the revolt. They might actually come. <laughs> Interesting. You may want to piece me out soon, buddy. I, I gotta keep an eye on that. Um, okay, we are sieging that. Just doesn't look like it. There's the trebuchet. I see it now. The trebuchet. Okay, so we got that. Let's. Um, I mean, we have double the numbers. I don't really want to cross over that huge strait, though. If I start moving, he's going to come here. Maybe we just hang out in Breda and let him come here. Yeah, I'm going to do that. Or, you know, we could just assault through that and end the war. I'd rather bust up his army, though. That's going to be my land. There we go. You're not coming after me, are you? Keep my eye on you. Go killed all those people. Um, my guess is you don't want to be in this war anymore. Great. By the time he gets that, he'll probably already send me mine. Our courtier, who has no husband, who is strong and 37, might fancy me. Um, we're kind, we're scarred, we're a child of the concubine, we're proud, yeah, we're gregarious. Yeah, sure. Gave her a good tumble, which means she's pregnant now, which means we do have an heir. Okay, so he accepts our offer of peace. We need to get rid of, uh, what did we just take? Cleave. And uh, this guy, our steward's ill. For shame. Uh, the greedy guy. Yeah, you. The one that likes us a lot. Congratulations. You won the lottery. You have a county that's going to be useless for like a decade. You there. <laughs> I want Colm. <laughs> Uh, 
yeah, it seems like we do have an ambition and we just can't see it. Oh, now we can choose weird stuff. Um, it wants me to read it. Okay, so we got London. You're still staying over there, and that's good. Come on, dude. I don't want to kill your army. Not yet, anyways. All right, we killed everybody. These <laughs> these mercenaries are good at killing everybody. Oh man, 30 minutes. More prisoners, perfect. Uh, more stuff to assault through. Ratio is not great, but I'm uh, going to end this episode here. And in the next episode, we're going to hopefully take this territory and then declare war uh, for Sussex probably, or maybe here. Kind of separate those. Not that that really matters as much in CK2. I don't know, we'll figure out which one we want. But thanks for watching, folks. And actually, if they're going to take that one, we'll take Sussex. Uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you all next time. Bye.